So I just had the like probably craziest travel day I've ever had in all of the time I've ever traveled. And it started with us booking our tickets and apparently we improperly booked them. So it took over an hour to change them to be proper. And then we get on the flight, someone has a medical emergency. We have no idea what it was about halfway through our flight. And so when we land, EMS had to come on board, border security, all of that. Then we land and find out that WestJet is on strike and our flight home has actually been canceled. So we're stuck in Canada until further notice. And I literally mean until further notice because they have not assigned us a new flight. Then it takes forever to book a hotel because there is a huge convention happening and big festival happening. And so I book a hotel. It is terrifying and sketchy. So I had to find a new one and here we are. So I said, hell no, am I staying in this sketchy ass hotel with my two kids who are babies? And I was worried about my safety. So I had to look and find a hotel, which took me over an hour because everything is fully booked. I finally found a Marriott that would take us, thank God. And our room is gorgeous. They upgraded us because um, we really needed a room with two queen beds, but I couldn't find anywhere that would let me book two queen beds. The guy was so nice. He could see how like frazzled I am because it's been a hell of a day. I have not really slept and neither has my husband. We are, it is 10.40 p.m. here in Canada, but it's like 6.30 in the morning in Rome and we have not slept and we have been up since 7.30 in the morning yesterday. So it's been quite the day. Thankfully, both the kids have been amazing. They slept on the flight. They're sleeping in the car right now. They've been freaking troopers, but sometimes traveling, it hits the fan and you just gotta hold on and be prepared. But um, I'm praying that we can get on a flight tomorrow. Hundreds of people were redirected. And so it, it's possible we're gonna be stuck here for at least two days. Send me all your good vibes, please. And maybe some fun things to do in Calgary.